Welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in on this beautiful Thursday morning. We love you for it. Now let's have a little bit of fun. Um, the Proteus cricket team, we know they're on a very hard-earned break at the moment. Uh, but that doesn't mean that some of our local, uh, local cricketing superstars haven't been very busy sharing their passion for the game. And while some players have been using the break to get some much-needed downtime, our next guest, he's been out and about sharing his love of cricket and doing it in an incredible way as well through the JP21 project and to give us a little bit of an update is JP himself obviously dude welcome back thank you very much thanks um, for having me. you're supposed to be having a break now guy um, <laughs> crazy time in the world of cricket obviously a new man at the helm coming in over September um, we wish Otis really well in his tenure um, your new boss, I, I would have to yes, say. So I'm yes. not going to ask you to, to offer your opinion <laughs> there. I will elaborate, no. <laughs> uh, But lots of hard work to be done there as well, ahead of the, the tour against Bangladesh. Um, the world of cricket is crazy at the moment, so I'm sure you, you've needed a break after the England tour, looking what West Indies have done to England at the moment. I'm sure they're feeling like they needed a break at the moment. Um, give us an update of what you have been up to, my friend. How did the, the JP21 project, um, your foundation, come about? Yeah, in a nutshell, it's... Uh a primary school cricket league program uh, for, for the development of kids. And we operate in the Mitchell's Plain and Stromerton area. This is the area where I grew up. Uh, this is an area that's stricken by gangsterism, by alcohol abuse, drug abuse. So for us, it was just about trying to give kids an opportunity, um, you know, getting them away from the negative influences of the community. And there's no better way to do it than the beautiful game of cricket. And uh, this is the way I know how to do it. So. Yeah. Uh, we've been operating for just over two years now. I mean, we've, we've had a massive, massive success story so far. Uh, 54 schools, uh, in wow. primary schools alone in, in the area, and we've managed to get 36 schools playing cricket now. So, yeah, great success story and, and lots of work still to be put in. How do you feel when you see the youngsters playing? Is it, do you get more of a kick out of that, seeing a young person take a wicket, score a, a, you know, a milestone in the, you know, on the pitch? How does that make you feel versus achieving a personal milestone? It's really pleasing to see and uh, giving kids opportunities. And especially those kids that don't get afforded the opportunities like we do. Uh, so when we, like, I mean, if you look at these pictures, uh, this is at Newlands. We have a Cricket Sixes tournament there uh, once a year. And just the, the opportunity to play at Newlands and Imagine be on the, pit, the, yeah, field, be on the pitch. It's such a great experience for them. And to see the joy in their face, the smiles, and for that uh, couple of hours that they're on the field, I mean, it's just taking them away from just the surroundings that they are surrounded by daily, you know. So it's, it's a great experience for us. And even if they don't have a long-term objective within cricket, you're just adding another layer to life, which is a beautiful thing. So Thanks, you're going to be captaining the Cape Town Knight Riders. <laughs> um, T20 Globals are coming around. This is a big shift. This is a big thing. Um, and very positive when you look at it from a cricket development. This surely is going to keep young cricketers in the game. This is a really big thing. It certainly is, and I think it's a big injection of, uh, well, I think from a domestic cricket point of view, it's a great injection for us. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a great privilege and a great honor to captain uh, a Cape Town local team. Um, you know, it's not something necessarily I thought about a lot when I was growing up to captain, but to be afforded the opportunity, uh, especially in my home ground, I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be awesome. So, dude, I think the most important thing is we need people to get on board, private sector to get on board. How can we support you and your foundation? Where do you need the help? Well, we've actually got a great uh, festival coming up on the 17th of December at uh, the prestigious Valdivia uh, Estate. And what it is, it's a corporate cricket day. And, uh, you know, there are four teams. Uh, the competition is eight aside. And uh, we're playing basically a semi final and a final. We've got four captains. Uh, the captains are myself, Faf Duplessis, Morning Morkel, and Avi de Villiers. So it's a great rivalry. It's not going to be competitive at all. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to have great uh, cricketing legends, some sporting legends there uh, to, be, to partake in it. And the, the team owners will have an opportunity to fill four spots. So they will have an opportunity to rub shoulders uh, with the greats of the game and just interact with them. And we're obviously calling on the local faithful here in, in the Mother City to come out and support us on the 17th, as I said, the 17th of December. Uh, it's going to be a great fun day out. Uh, the Black Ties have just agreed to, to cool. do some live entertainment for us. So great family day. So pull in. I mean, the tickets, tickets are on sale already at uh, iTicket.com. So 
Oh, they're going to go quickly, man. I, I can honestly say from having taken part in a similar kind of event alongside some of these sporting legends, those are the memories that I hold most dear. It's worth it. You'll keep it for an entire lifetime. Thank you're you, so sir. proud of what you're doing Thank on you and much. off the pitch, sir. I know um, you've got a, a hill to climb heading towards <laughs> that Bangladesh, uh, Bangladesh tour, but um, we, we love you, dude. Thank you so much for everything. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks for having me. JP Germany Cheers. and the JP21 Project. Go and support sports as a development tool.